I'm going to take a quick look at Michael Harding's Naphthol Red pigment. It's a semi-opaque red, but when you spread it thinly you get these lovely pink colours from it, pink notes. So I'm interested to see what kind of pink it makes if I put some warm white with it, the lead white alternative, warm white. It does make a very good pink, a sort of baby pink. You can see that that warm white is slightly stiffer than some of the other colours. But yeah, that's making a really good sort of medium pink. It's not too peachy, but not veering off towards lilac either. with good, strong, transparent Indian yellow. Let's see what happens. A really fiery orange, sort of burnt orange. Indian yellow often gives sort of more burnt oranges, but that's a really strong colour. And with a touch of the warm white in there, we should get a really glowing orange. That's quite lovely. Hmm, really hot, summery colour. I'm curious to see if it goes brown with this permanent green light. No, it's going to more of a mauve colour. I guess the blue notes in the red and the blue notes in the green are making more of a mauvey grey than a brown. I guess we'd need some of this yellow in here to make more of a brown. Let's push it over there. There we go, that's more of a red-brown. But here we're getting a really interesting mauve colour. And I also, I'm also curious to see what happens if we go with a Prussian blue, really powerful, vivid blue, and see what happens with the red in there, if that makes a purple. It's quite a mid-red, so I don't suppose it's going to go really plummy or really royal purple. It's going to something more aubergine, I think. It's also going very, very dark, so it's quite difficult to see what we're getting. I might add a little of the lighter colour just to see what we've got in there. That's quite pretty, quite a delicate... You can feel the similarity with the pink there, but... The Prussian blue is making for a less saturated purple than, say, ultramarine might have done. So there we have it. Naphthol red. <laughs>